All right, you guys. Um, in this video, I'm gonna show you guys how I created that edit where I kind of went through the this thing in front of me and went into the basement map and Google tag. So how I did it? Well, first you want to get rid of the Oculus menu at the beginning because I record on Oculus. So you want to clip it out, and of course at the end when you stop it, you probably don't want that in your video. Then after that, you wanna. Go to the part just when you just before you hit your face on it, kind of like any time, and then just clip or split it right there. And then after that, uh, find a good part where you can because you need to go and cut out, customize cut out, and then go to brush. Once you're in brush, um, whoops, just try to go around the frame because you need to go around it. Um, then, once you have that, it might look kind of wonky, but you can you try to make it look better. It's probably good for now. Now I'll wait for that to generate. Once it's done, uh, it should look pretty good. Okay, if it's like this, where it kind of glitches over, you can go back and customize. And then you want to brush in the part. Again. <clears throat> I'm not going to to generate again. Future me here. You guys don't actually have to do um, this frame right now. You guys can do anything. As long as it's this one solid color. Because that tends to work the most for me. But you guys can try whatever. Okay, once it's done... Hit the check mark and see how it looks. Okay, it's kind of, kind of glitched at the beginning, but I don't really need this part right here, so. so I'll split that, delete that, and then you'll have you'll end up with this. Uh, and then go to the rest of your clip. So, for example, I want it to transition, like when I jump like this. So I need to clip it while I'm moving and then delete the rest of this so i should have this right here and then what you want to do is you want to click on the clip where you um use the cutout on and then you want to find the overlay button and overlay it so then it, it should look kind of weird right now but if you want it moving like this you don't have to do anything but what i like to do i like to go in here and find freeze and you can freeze it and then yeah you can adjust it to how you want so it can be froze for left less and then it'd be like that uh, that actually looks kind of good for now yeah um basically that's it you guys can add effects if you want like i had some filters on which i'm guessing you guys know how to do but Maybe if you want it to make it look more smoother, you could add pull in. But I don't really know if that does. You, yeah, you can you can mess around with lots of stuff. But I'll show you guys how to. I got that outline on the picture frame, or on this uh whatever you want to call this right here, the billboard. Uh, I got the outline. If I click on this video, I believe yeah. And then I go to cut out. And then you go to cut out stroke. And then you can find... I don't know. None of these really work. This one's kind of weird. This one's... Yeah, the solid one works the best. This one just... I don't know. Yeah, this, the solid stroke works best right here. You can adjust the size. Do whatever you want. Opacity so it goes more clear. And then in one of my videos, I just did purple. Because why not? Yeah, and that's basically it. Um, thanks for watching. Mm -hmm. And that's my, that's my video.